Welcome to This Is Important, a production of iHeartRadio, the show where we only talk about what's the most important, bottom line, critical thing happening on this planet. Today on This Is Important? The male human body can't go seven hours without jerking off. They show me a shit that doesn't stink. Oh, and you just put your hand in and go like, those are eyeballs. <laughs> What would you liken the feeling to immediately after? Are you getting like a dose of euphoria? Buckle up. Did we get it? We're back. Woof, 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 woof. <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't know. If Here we go, baby. <laughs> Have it your way. First of all, I would like to thank our fans for <laughs> loving the last episode as much as they did. Say I got a lot of sweet, sweet feedback. It was a best of luggage talk. Well, yeah, mm -hmm, regretfully. Mm -hmm. And I feel like the fans came out clamoring. They came out hot, loving the luggage talk, baby. So get ready for more right, sweet, yeah. sweet luggage talk in the future. And we're excited <laughs> to give it to you. Wait, did they? Did they, though? <laughs> Did they? They loved right. it. They loved it more than this right here. I don't yeah, know. Yeah. We're back. We're back. Yeah. The people that were in my DMs actually uh, surprising. I was like, wow, because I got like maybe 10 and 15 people in a row that were like, dude, Happy luggage talk. Love it. Hilarious whopper, luggage whopper, talk. Whopper, Fuck yeah, whopper, luggage whopper, talk. Whopper, squirt, squirt, that's luggage what... talk. Well, you got squirts. And then I was like, my God, I, this went over way better than I thought it was going to. And then I looked at Twitter. And Twitter uh -huh. was where you go oh. to be mean and nasty. I feel yeah. the DMs are where you right. you reach right. out to be kind of pleasant. And okay. uh, Twitter people were pretty pretty butthurt about it. Yeah. But now basically that I feel like are people still tweeting. Apparently, that's a great question, <laughs> Anders. Like, like what's happening on Twitter is. Yeah, Anders, apparently, yeah, it's still. I know, I, but I mean, like by and large, like right. are you guys tweeting? Absolutely not. I haven't mm, put a tweet out there. Large. I haven't put a tweet out there in probably f six years, by and large. Six years, by and large. Have you? Yeah, are we talking by and large, or we're talking? I guess I just we're, and by and large. When I go on there and I see people still tweeting, I'm like, <laughs> hot, 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 hot. What <laughs> is happening? It's like I it's know. like you graduated high school and you go back and everyone's still there. You're like, why aren't you on TikTok? <laughs> I'm not on TikTok, but. You should be on YouTube stories. What are you doing? Exactly. YouTube stories are, uh, what a fail. But exactly. You're, they're still on Twitter. That's the thing. You, the whole point of the internet is to fucking uh -huh. turn and burn, man. What are you still doing on Twitter? <laughs> and what are you, and what are you saying? Like, what are you, you've, if you've been on for, let's say 10 years, what are you still saying? Because if you've been on Twitter mm -hmm. for 10 years and you're still <laughs> tweeting. Like 14. You're, you've got to be mm -hmm. super fucking annoying. Right. In a major way, you kind of have to be. Because it's like, what is your ritual where you have to put this thing out there? And how often are you fucking tweeting? It's like, do you ever shut up? <laughs> Honestly, like, shut up. I don't even go there because I don't want to read it. Well, th yeah, for sure. For sure. People that tweet too much, definitely you look at them and say, do you ever shut up? Right. Because they don't. But yeah, thank uh, you. I will say that, that uh, it is the still the best place to go to see what's happening right now, like in pop culture. Because I'm not that plugged in okay. with like, pop culture stuff. Like for what? You mean news? Yeah. Like okay. you know, just like a thing that happened or like a weird trending viral trending thing or like why is but ain't isn't hood clips gonna post some about it like <laughs> hood clips is on twitter though hood clips yeah but like like n weeks later oh huh? yeah like days and days later You're, really twitter has their their finger on the pulse i would say yes uh -huh. i remember last time i used it was fires 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 shut up bitch okay <laughs> fires that's an <laughs> okay. Like Adam, what's an example where you're like, I gotta get on Twitter, like legit. You can say, I'll give you one joke, and then I want to hear her legit. I'll tell you right now, sports, instant sports. You can watch along something yeah. that is still live. It's for things that are still live. 
Like fires. House of Highlights. House of Highlights is posting highlights in game. Yeah, but you can't really like scroll through what people are thinking unless you're going to read the comments on House of Highlights on Instagram. That's just, that's a trash graveyard, dude. You don't want to see that one girl who posts the first comment every time. It's bots. What? There's there's always that one guy. I forget his name, but he comments on everything. He goes, blank is <laughs> the goat for sure. It's not it's not him. It's who do you know who I'm talking about is blank Stephanie. is the goat. No cap. That's what he says every uh, time. Yay, he's talking about Kanye with the, the big booty basketball girl. Yeah, basketball girl. Stephanie. I'm not talking about cotton. That was the guy, though. He would say, yay is the goat, yep. no cap. Like, he'd be the first one on all his posts. This is deep internet fucking dorkdom right here. Is it? I feel like we think it is, and then you can ask a zillion people that know. Yeah, but he's still, that guy's still going. Yeah, well, you can't give up. <laughs> See, Kyle? What the fuck are you guys talking about? You're just talking about somebody who's still tweeting? What are you talking about right now? <laughs> Kyle quit when Elon Musk bought Twitter. Kyle yeah. was out. Yeah. Well, fuck Tesla. Okay. okay. Yeah. Yeah. I'm Why over would you it. ever say that? I'm I it, they're they're fine, but I'm just like uh I'm over the robots. Well, yeah, it you you turned your back on Tesla. Why did you turn your back you on guys Tesla? Getting a, I was thinking about getting one. I'm not turning my back on it. I'm just kind of over it because when my my Y has been taking a shit. I've had an X, a mm. three, and a Y. I've had three of them. Okay. And I've watched the God, human God, element. God damn, God. bro. God damn. Stick with the Jeez. winner. I've had experiences with them, and I've it was great at first, and now you cannot talk to a human. You cannot. Like, I've had... Oh, yeah, yeah. Customer service-wise. Yeah, like if something... Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're saying customer service is bad for... Uh, Tesla. It's all, and this is going to make me sound old, but and I'm a, a millennial who wants the old ways. But like, mm -hmm. I really do want to talk to a human when it comes yeah. to my car. I want a human voice on the other end of the line, <laughs> like, and, and preferably English speaking human. If we're going to get into it, all right. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, whatever. I just it's so confusing. Like my car has died two times. The front motor has gone out. On the oh road, my. and then it's basically just like a fucking... Okay, okay, but Kyle, Kyle, what's the second, what other language, what's the second best language acceptable to you? Well, that I would be able to understand is probably like French or Spanish, oh. I think. Okay. <laughs> so. Oh, yeah, I, dude, you speak such fluent, beautiful French. I, yeah. would, I would love to hear you have a conversation with us. It is crazy how often French people are like problem solving my like technical stuff. They're like bonjour, yeah. and I'm like, oh, this person's not gonna understand me. So is right. that right? Is that right? I feel like I've never talked to a French person ever in your whole life. I, and I've been to France. <laughs> You've yeah. been to France. And you just, what? <laughs> Adam, <laughs> are you being sarcastic, yeah. Jers? Oh my god! Obviously, but like, uh, I do right. like that you're like I've been to France and I've never. Um, yeah, I was jo I was joking. We're back. I refuse to talk to French. <laughs> We're back, but in, okay. So, so look at this. When you guys are chunking so hard, this have, this podcast sucks. <laughs> mm -hmm. You are chunking pretty hard over there. <laughs> it's always sucked. This one's yeah. This one's a little tough to time right now. It's going to be tough for Todd to time this one. But <laughs> the, the clap in was off. <laughs> right, right. <laughs> the clap um, in. So wait, you had a Tesla problem. So did we, by the way. Dude, X, my really? X crapped out. Needed a whole new battery. What was your problem? Mine, uh. so the front motor went out m on multiple occasions, which that means that when you hit the brake, it goes like, and it's just, yo, how many miles you got on this? I don't know. It's a lease. Scary. I think I have like, it's Bonky only 17,000 miles, dude. I got it mile zero. Oh, lemon law, lemon law, that shit. Oh, damn, dude. Well, I lease it. So it doesn't matter. You'll get all your lease money back. Oh, hello. Talk to me about this. What are you talking about? I did it when I had, I got the first, like, I got nothing bad to say about Volvo. Terrific machines. Well, okay. They are. The f I got like their first electric hybrid that they had with the XC90, like way back in the day, 2016, maybe. And it just, the, the motor and the engine weren't talking to each other in mm -hmm. the right way. And I had to go to the shop of multiple times and if you just have that information and you submit for a lemon law here in california and you're under i think 30 or thirty-five thousand miles you get every penny back dude so that's what this is this is uh, this is in the lemon law 
I can get all this back. What's the lemon law? That's if you- Blake doesn't understand. Uh, you you walk off with a sucks. shit car, it's called a lemon. Uh, they call cars that yeah. don't work, that are brand new, a lemon. Lemons, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm aware of yeah. that. I am yeah. aware of that, but I was unaware that there's a law okay. where if you okay. get a bad car, they fully reimburse you? Is that what you're saying? Yeah. I How did come we don't do that with more, more stuff? Um, I, yeah, like a printer, I think. Yeah, I don't know, run for governor or something. Okay. I think because cars, pro yeah, Blake for governor, dude. <laughs> dude I, I'd vote for you if you you've stood on that platform. Mm -hmm. I want a lemon law for everything. Now, Kyle, I have a question about why your engines keep crapping out. Like, are you curing beef jerky on the engine? Or, like, what are you doing to these cars? Are you watching tons of tons of porno on the? On yeah, are yeah, you that's... like watching? Are you <laughs> fully? Are you hitting the auto drive and just and, 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 on, on your auto? Well, the you said auto that. drive. The auto drive allows for some selective viewing if you want to. It, it, <laughs> it, you say for some. Now you said was the was the sound the that, engine made something like this? Is that what it says? Because <laughs> the engine is making torque noises, that mm -hmm. might be something else. Well, yeah, uh, Kyle, do you, t real talk, Did have you watched porno? And Durs, too. <laughs> have you watched porno while it's self-driving? Just, like, kind of kicked back? Yeah. And don't lie. You're under <laughs> oath. You want me to, you want, why do we have to real talk this? What is this? I can answer this two different ways. Yeah, real talk. Yeah. I don't want. I don't want any yeah. fake talk. I don't I want. I never this. watched porno on my car. No, but ha right. Ne Has porno been on okay. in my car? Okay. So yeah. <laughs> yeah, I can't yeah. control. Sure. Sure. Kyle's on the spot here. <laughs> sure. Yeah. yeah for yes. sure. Yeah. Okay. Well, Kyle ha on the main screen. And where did you? <laughs> oh. No, not on the main screen. But you can. So on the main screen, you're cruising along. Yeah, you're on uh, what the five freeway. You're cruising along. Did you mm -hmm. then? Now you're just. <laughs> I get it because you you take those long drives from up north mm -hmm. d down oh, yeah. to back to Lonely. LA, and it's like a what a six hour drive, an eight hour drive. What is it? You're going right past Harris Ranch. It's six a, hours. It's a, in a in a Tesla, it's like seven because you got to charge and you got to stop and charge, mm. a motherfucker. Mm. You can't make it all the way up there. No. Okay, so it's like seven hours, and we all know the human, Where? the male human body can't go seven hours without Three. jerking off. Mm -hmm. So yep. you, so you had this, you had to, yeah, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, bro. Yeah, I don't have to stop, dude. I love but it's it, like dude. The, the thing's auto See? driving, dude. So, and you're wondering why your car is going haywire, but you're out here going to you porn. Yeah, there's porn jizz up. in the circuit board. <laughs> no, you guys, you're tripping. It's not on the main screen. It's harder than you think to put something on the main screen because oh, Tesla's got deals, proprietary deals with everything right. and stuff. So yeah. What's that? Wait, what do you mean, like model model X hamster over over there? You're saying, <laughs> you're saying there's like, <laughs> right? It's Rancho Fucko. <laughs> <laughs> Rancho fucko. <laughs> There's parental controls or something that makes it so you can't access porno on your Tesla screen. Is that what you're saying? I don't surf the net on it. You can go use their theater mode to get into like your Hulu <laughs> or your or your whatever your fucking Water Netflix trash. and shit. But that's about it. I promise Elon Musk is not limiting what you can watch on your Tesla. So what do you do? What do you do on this computer besides look at porno yeah. most days? <laughs> well, the computer is. Maps? <laughs> yeah, I guess the maps are helpful. <laughs> what are you looking at? Maps? <laughs> you fucking dork. Yeah. Well, the, yeah, maps. But like, you're doing everything. It's a Tesla. It's a fucking Bose computer with wheel or a Bose speaker with wheels. You know what I mean? It's like, it's doing everything. Mm -hmm. I guess. Well, a Bose speaker is just a speaker. <laughs> a Bose speaker? Yeah, it's a speaker. Yeah. Was well, Kyle thought he was dropping some shit right there? He's like, it's like a Bose speaker on wheels. Are you feeling me? It's com it's a computer, bro. That's a that's just a speaker. <laughs> yeah, it's a good sound system. <laughs> and you're like, whoa! So it's just a speaker, then? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. <laughs> you know what I mean? The fucking thing. You can't touch it. You can't touch anything. There's nothing in it. It's just like you're just. It's the computer. That's what? what do you mean by it's a Bose speaker on wheels? This is what's so scary. This is why I'm I am not into it. Like I said, five uh -huh. years. <laughs> See, this is why I wanted to dig into this because I knew there was gold here. Yeah, yeah, there is. Because, dude, when you're in a Tesla, which is essential. 
when you're in a Tesla and essentially it is an uh-huh. iPhone, a speaker, yeah. a piece of fucking tech that you Wait, get. A speaker and an iPhone are two very different things. Those are two very different things. A speaker and an iPhone, yeah, iPhones have so many functions. Donkey! A speaker does one thing. Do you know when your phone is on the fritz? Adam, you know this. You have a tech ghost. Okay. Adam, he's getting personal now. <laughs> yeah, this is good. Adam, you know this. You have a tech ghost. I do have a tech ghost. Yeah, it haunted me last night. It really did. Uh, and what did you hold up for the record? <laughs> That's why I'm scared to get a Tesla. I, I w- That's why. My phone, my <laughs> shitty phone that's on the fritz that like it just spazzes out on me. Like today, right. the, it just didn't work. <laughs> like I was trying to find maps to yeah. get home right. and it just didn't work. And I had to use my brain. Whoa, mm-hmm. that's not good. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> that's not good. Yeah, dude. And it, no, it really, I've lived in L.A. for 20 years, and I was like, I was like down. Pizza, pizza. I, I was fairly close, and I was like, oh, fuck. My mm. maps don't work, and I had right. to get mm. back home. And it probably took me an extra, like, six minutes because I just took I, a fucking straight-up loop-de-doo route. And, of course, there was construction on the on the road and i was of like this, this fucking of course sucks yeah. man i need my maps baby well that's, that's what it, that's what i'm know. saying i'm so sorry dude i'm so sorry dude but yeah no i i fully have a tech ghost that's why i don't want uh a tesla yeah. i'm afraid to get it chloe was like i think we should get a tesla or uh or something uh, for the next car like an electronic what, car would you look and at that i i'm like legit frightened that i would get it <laughs> and it would explode <laughs> hey you know what you tell her you tell her you go close you go, Chloe, we can't do it. It's basically a bow speaker on the <laughs> And dude, yeah, it's a bow I promise speaker. you, she'll go, got it? Yeah. I'm sorry I even brought it up. I get what you're saying. Yeah, she'll, she'll completely understand. So, yeah, hey. I Yeah, I get that. I get that. <laughs> uh, okay, listen. How'd I get it? There's not, And is there anything to touch? I've heard that. Mm, no, apparently not. It, dude, it's like a... It's like a beats. It's like a beats pill with an engine. All right, that's basically what it is. Huh. I can exactly. It's a beats by Dre. I guess I keep hearing that, huh? When I go on Twitter, uh... well, the thing is, when it starts to die, when you're out there and it and it fails, it's it's like it might as well be a pair of headphones. <laughs> it's it might as well be yeah. Turn the Bluetooth off and on. You have to like har- over the ear. Headphones. You hard reset your fucking car. You're like out there hard resetting this thing, and I'm like, sure. no, Fuck and it. it has auto drive. And so you're like, well, what happens? What the fuck is going on here? Yeah, but what if your fucking engine block breaks? What if your carburetor pops or your blood? Yeah, and then all of a sudden, like, well, you can't even get it towed. I can't even choose who tows it. All the weird videos you downloaded from LimeWire start to pop up yeah. on the screen. Yeah. I heart date. <laughs> I Heart Deep Throat right. is popping up. I don't want people seeing that. Yeah, all the stains in the car. Right. Come on. Yeah, the guys out there to help help you. Yeah, help you fix your car. Yeah. Well, Kyle, you were bringing up an interesting thing. Morpheus downloads. Is there a triple A for specifically Teslas? Yes. Like, or do they send send out the same dude who's you know? This part of the company is. It's it's up to you. It's good. It's just, just like a Geek Squad guy rolls mm-hmm. up in, in his Tesla. Yeah. Let me take a look at this. You can't choose who is <laughs> towing you, right? You know I what I mean? <laughs> like, well, <laughs> what? <laughs> see ya. Yeah, sure. Like, you can't, like, look. No, you just hit the app. I mean, this part is kind of dope, but this yeah. is the part that's a catch-22. You hit the app. You say, mm-hmm. I have problems. And then what happened to me recently is they're like, we're going to just leave your car. Leave your right. car. And then you get a ride wherever you're at, and you just leave your fucking car, and we'll come pick it up when we have time. Adam's already like, sounds awesome. (laughs) What is wrong with that? You just you just leave it with the keys? No, they can hack in. It was weird when I was out and I was going to dinner up in Calistoga, and it was like all of a sudden I have there was no cabs, there was no. I had to leave this thing on the side of the road, and it was in the middle of nowhere at like eleven o'clock. And then you just hitchhiked to. uh, I'm in the middle. Nowhere. <laughs> Wait, and there's the difference. We got a ride. I'm sorry. We did. We got a ride. But it was like I'm sorry. Okay, look, you've got Whopper, Whopper, Junior, Whopper, <laughs> right. Double, wha- <laughs> Right, right. What? So if you're if you're in a regular ice combustion engine car, 
Uh, and it breaks down. What's the Water difference? Water trash. You can call any tow truck to come pick right. you up. You can call the nearest tow truck to come get you. Right. Right? This is you a, can't well, do that. Yeah, you could do anything with your phone. Yeah, that's not. Well, no, you have to. You have to. They have to send their. Because it's. It's. You can't unlock the wheels. You can't just grab the car. You have to go in and program it and stuff. I'll, go, I'll grab it. All right. Watch me. <laughs> with the, the wheels lock. It's a fucking computer. It's turned off. Yeah, but can't you put it into neutral or something? Yeah, you put it in a neutral. Sure. So that's kind of annoying Hold that you back. can't just get it towed to where you want it to be. Yeah, that's weird. No, it goes It goes to... You have to wait for Tesla to get out there. So really, you you better not be driving somewhere super remote because... This is where I, this is where I ran into like the... Uh... But if I may, Adam, if mm. I may... Mm. You may. At least you know that it's going to a Tesla cert... <laughs> you, hey, Durs, you may. Thank you. At least you know it's going to a Tesla certified like place as opposed to like those classic 90s movies where they're like <laughs> well I looked at it and it looks like it's going to be here for about a week and a half and it's going to cost you about $2,300. No you're right unless, you're right that's a good point. Unless that pretty little wire for yours over there yeah. and you're like what? What is happening? Honey run. That and I just... still yeah it is it, you're right because that's the other side. Honey? That's the other side of it. Every 90s movie this can't believe this guy's highway robbery. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. Unless that tall drink of water. Honey what do you think? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'm not leaving you here. <laughs> Honey, what do you think? I know what I think, but what do you think? Got a pretty mouth. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> you can walk you can walk a couple miles up the road. They'll help you out. I'm not leaving you here. What? I, sure. It's fine. I'm going to be fine. <laughs> it's fine. He seems like a nice guy. <laughs> Meanwhile, he's just cranking down mm -hmm. in the corner. Mm -hmm. <laughs> no, he seems great. What do you mean? <laughs> Cleaning the oil off the hands. Like, uh -huh. Look in his hands like, yeah, it's going to be about 2300 Unless you leave that pretty little wife of yours wants to stay here with the girl. Yeah, that's... that's. Honey, I'm not leaving you. What? No, he seems great. Meanwhile, he's just twisting his nipple. Mm -hmm. right. He's just trying to twist the head off his dong. <laughs> I would love to watch everyone's audition for that role. <laughs> Just the lights. <laughs> you got a pretty mouth, huh? <laughs> yeah, who could be the creepiest? I don't know. No. I Look at him. I feel like Durs has <laughs> a, he could pull off a good creep. <laughs> the mustache helps right now. With that with that mustache, I feel you you got a little little yeah, yeah, that helps. Durs is good because Go he can turn off his eyes. Kyle, I feel like is he's he's central casting choice, first choice. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. And I feel Kyle's first choice as far as central casting goes. I don't I don't think I can I don't think I can turn off my eyes like uh Durs. But I think Blake would also have a pretty f fun take on the character. Well, you <laughs> had me at the twist in the nipples. Like go dead in the eyes? Well, one of them will. Right. I can try. <laughs> Yeah, Who, look at him. His eyes can go dead. <laughs> look who's at the guy <laughs> from the Fairly Brothers movies? It's like Undertaker. Who was like... <laughs> remember how the Fairly Brothers always had like that, like... They almost had their own, like, players, their own little stable of actors that they put in every movie. And there's one guy who'd be like... <laughs> uh huh. What was that fucking guy? <laughs> that dude was in everything. He was so good, but he played like this. I think he played this mechanic role. I don't know if I know who you're talking about. I know that they do have a stable. <laughs> I don't know, but yeah, I liked how. Uh, I feel like a lot of old like <laughs> '90s comedy guys did that. Like the Sandler does that, where the same guys are in a lot of his movies. And yes, yeah, shout out to your boy. And the Fairly Brothers did that. And, yes, yeah, he's the know. same ensemble. Yes. Yeah, we were gonna do that with Wayman, but. Remember our boy? Who we were gonna put in. <laughs> we we're gonna do that with the work. Oh, it's yeah. movie. <laughs> Try yeah. it. Failed. Uh, I found out that the, the, the dad from Kindergarten Cop was from, like, Mobile when I was filming there. They were like, you know, nobody ever came out of Mobile except for that guy. And I was like, yeah. Crisp. I was like, yo, that's the best dude to ever come out. Right. He's in the Fairly Brothers. The dad from Kindergarten, the, like, the, the, the. Dominic, I'm your father guy. The, the, the slick back hair guy. Yeah, he's really good. I know, and he's from Mobile. Oh, that guy's the best. He's basically TK. 
Thomas Kellogg. Yeah, he's yeah. Thomas Kellogg. Uh, but um, he's there, Thomas Kellogg. I don't know, is he? But he's in big movies. But he was in a bunch sure. of Fairly yeah. Brothers movies. He was one of their like players. The f- yeah, he's got a weird. He's got a little thing about him. <laughs> and Three O'clock High, legendary movie. If you've if you've never seen Three O'clock High, I have not seen that. Is that a John C- Cusack? No, but it's an 80s movie. Kuzak. John Kuzak. John Kuzak? Kuzak. <laughs> Kuzak movie. Yes. About like a... a Kuzak? A kid who like Kuzak? comes into the bully. And the bully's like, oh, I'm yeah. going to kick the shit out of you at 3 o'clock. So then he's got yeah. the entire school day to like get out of it. And then they redid that movie. I mean... With uh, Charlie Day and Ice Cube. Absolute right. trash. Right. A ridiculously stupid movie. Right? Didn't they tr- try to redo that movie? Yeah. If, like, uh... Yeah, it was bad. Oh, it was called Fist Fight. They made that movie yeah. called Fist Fight. Yeah. I feel like that... Fist Fight. Yeah, I feel like that one didn't work quite as well as they wanted it to. Better better title. Better title, 3 O'Clock High. I mean, it's better. Well, yeah. it's. I guess it's a play uh-huh. on uh, High Noon. Right. I know what Fist Fight's about to be. You... I'm not sure I know what three o'clock high is. That's why it's better. Well, it's based on high noon, three o'clock. Well, that was during. No, I need my movies to be called. Well, that's why it's better, Blake. <laughs> that's right. You're one of <laughs> no. those guys. I um... need my movies to be called yeah. plain. P L A N E. Saw it. I saw it with Rodge Man the other day. Ooh. Uh, what did you I see? Could... Plain? plain. Plain. What is this movie? Uh, Explain to me what this is. What do you think it is, bitch? <laughs> Well, okay, bitch. Hot, talk to me, bitch. What is it? It's a plane goes down in the Philippines, and then they got to, like, survive. These, like, gorilla dudes are coming after them. And it's called plane? Oh, that's not what I thought it was about. <laughs> Just kidding. I don't like you anymore. Yeah, this is... We're breaking it. We're breaking up. It's done. It's over. <laughs> I'm not saying you're breaking up. I'm saying we're breaking up. Yeah. Should we tell them? Uh, it's Gerard <laughs> Butler. It's basically Gerard Butler doing one of his like, s- <laughs> is this thing on? Straight to streaming movies or whatever. But this one went to theaters, and I went with a bunch of comedy writers, which you guys know is not like my thing to do to like go to a a movie and shit all over it live. <laughs> yeah, right. That's gonna be loud. Yeah. Like in like continuously the entire time while everyone else <laughs> is trying to watch it for real. Bullet! Yeah, they're like, I actually really like Gerard Butler. I actually think Gerard Butler has like a kind of a cool career. I like that he's just like, you know what? Burn. Fuck it. I'm going to, I like Blake, Blake, acting. Yeah. I like being on set. I like making movies. They're not putting me in A-list big movies, but they are putting me in in these like just big action movies. I'm like, it's fun. I wish more people. Did you say big? Well, yeah, right. Well, well big but like he did a lot of well there wasn't he in he was in big action movies wasn't he like uh law abiding citizen i think is one he's 300 and 300 yo look there's no doubt homie has a career Mm -hmm. and he did olympus falling down and and whatever the other falling down was and he's built a career off of so yes those are the movies those are the movies that kind of uh Mm -hmm. took him into that world of like essentially just financing a movie and then just getting like yeah, and Liam, uh, Liam, what's his Fuck name? It. Neeson, uh, the older Gallagher. guy. Neeson. Uh, yeah, Liam Neeson. He he's kind of doing the same thing now, where you're just like <laughs> it's another. Well, that's because he told everybody that he wanted to fight black dudes in his dreams, and they were like, "You can go that way." <laughs> oh yeah. Wait, he said what? that. <laughs> yeah, you can go that way and make those movies, and he was like, "Okay." What did he say? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he had some controversial uh, things he said for sure. Look, I'm I getting you, this wrong for sure. You shouldn't allow every every <laughs> old man. You shouldn't give every old man a microphone and let him just go off. Yeah, because they're gonna say some wild shit. He, he was being interviewed and said something about like somebody in his family was like attacked by somebody who happened to be black, and it would. It, he was so angry by it that he went out walking, and he was like, "Oh, I remember." Right. He's like, I mean, I don't know what it would have happened if I ran into somebody black. I think I would have like beat them up or tried to kill them. And they were like, what? <laughs> like, wow. I, I didn't. And they were talking about racism and whatever. <laughs> well, no, 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 wait. <laughs> and they were wait, like, wait, wait, wait. sir, you're on the Comic Con red carpet. <laughs> <laughs> they're like too late. Yeah. And they're, and, and they're lucky. 
You're um, live at Comic Con. <laughs> <laughs> right. Yeah. Oh, shit. Is, is this thing on? Yes. Yeah, how old is that dude? This is, I'm Josh from MTV. <laughs> this is a very. Allegedly. I'm just promoting the wolf movie. Yeah. Right. <laughs> this is angry, sad, confused. Uh, I'm just Gideon <laughs> yeah. Yego. Uh, I was angry. <laughs> I was angry and I was We're sad. just doing a fun bit. <laughs> um, so, How? yeah, after that, they were pretty much like, so the movies you're going to make are over this way. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Have fun. And by the way, he still makes a grip because nobody in like a ton of countries gives a shit about what he said. Mm -hmm. um, <laughs> and uh, he's still making money. Yeah, well, what an absolute Wait, insane yeah. thing to say, but uh, I, I I hope he just was saying it out of context. How old is that dude? How old is Liam Neeson? Well, but he was just saying, like, it... Let's check. He's just saying yeah. how it affected him, that he was like, I, I can see how yeah. these things happened. Thank, good, thank God it didn't happen to me. da 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 da, da. He's got to be 75, 77. Yeah. Maybe say that to your therapist or something, not not Josh from MTV. <laughs> yeah, for sure. Yeah, you got to say that to, to someone else. Right. It looks like he was born in... Oh, great math. Uh, 70... No, that's his early life. 70? 63? No, born? 69! He was born no. in 63? I think he's older than that, right? <laughs> uh, 52. What do you mean? Bo yeah, he's older than that. 52. There we go. 52. There we go. We got there. <laughs> Sorry. No. He's age 70. He's age 70. <laughs> okay. Whoa. So he is 70. <laughs> wow. He's old, dude. He's you? age 70. Dude, that yeah. was tripping me out. Do you think you could take him? You know what? I feel like when we're 70, though, we're like okay. not that far off from 70. Like... Right. Durs is almost 70. Like, I feel <laughs> Damn we're there. going to, it's going to be there quicker than we think. And then we're not going to feel old. We're going to no. be like, but we're still cool and young. I already feel old. <laughs> we're, we're, you're talking about your groin exploding. What are you talking about? Blake will just be carrying a, a skateboard. Dude. Kyle's going to be like, I <laughs> well, my body will shut down, but mentally I'm still going to be a dumb, dumb idiot. I'm still going to be just do, doing chucks and gigs up here. Right. I can't wait for Blake to have that hair gray. <laughs> oh, Adam. Wait, that reminds me, dude. I saw that that footage of you getting your fucking like back cracked and shit. And I really want to know what that process was. Where? Is this on Twitter? He posted on <laughs> Insta. It wasn't. Twi it was hot Twitter, dude. It was trending. You didn't see that? Was this Twitter? I didn't see this. No, did you post this on Instagram? Yes, so it was on your store. Uh, I didn't. No, the... Yes, sir. <laughs> How the hell did I see it? <laughs> I did not. Uh, someone did. Uh, the the chiropractor did. Okay. Uh, uh, the chiropractor did, and then it became like a viral thing. Mm. Oh. <laughs> oh, I forgot. Blake wakes up, Googles you, then does stuff. Sorry. <laughs> right. He's got the Google alerts. <laughs> yeah, he, he, looks, at, he right. looks up my name. Now I can shit. Dude. Well, the bummer was, I like, I also like... Was in so much pain that day because I'm still in a lot of pain from my groin mm. and back. Right. And uh, I was going to this chiropractor in Charleston. It was really uh, he was doing great work. And so I th saw this guy online and hit him up. And he was like he was in Newport Beach. And so he's like, come on down. And I came on down and he did the craziest shit. He put my neck in like a strap and then like yeah. Oh, yeah. elongated me. And I honestly, uh -huh. I felt taller. It was crazy. Right. And he did all kinds of... I still was in a lot of pain afterwards, so it didn't really help in the same way that... <laughs> more pain. <laughs> I was actually, in a yeah. weird way, in more pain. Shut up! Shut up! I was in a ton of more pain. <laughs> but... it's, too, it's so much more, actually. New, new hurts. Uh, no, I mean, it, it just didn't... It didn't work in the way I, I really wanted it to, but... You thought it was going to be a magic bullet? What, do you think it was going to be an off switch? Did you think it was going to be an off switch? Where it's like crack, 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 crack. God, I ho I'm looking for the off switch, man. This yeah, I know. Me this too. pain is like it's 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 a year. I'm a year in to like not being able to do shit. Like I'm gonna I I gotta send you to my guy Adam. I had to get an MRI uh, this week on my back <laughs> because I got me too, homie. Major fucking <laughs> shit happening. Now they're like, you got to go talk to a surgeon, and I'm like, oh my god, really? Cause of pickleball uh, on your back? Oh, no. Why? Cause of pickleball? It's not because of pickleball. There's like the potato oh. chips, bro. This this dude, You're I've been going disaster, like the last my two weeks. <laughs> it's got to be the potato chips. It actually is because this dude's like, you have like, I knew it. 
You have so I'm numb and like you have a ruffle. <laughs> I have like a a growth on my fucking back. I have a growth on my fucking spine, dude. No. Yeah. Well, that's like, not good. From ruffles? I don't know yeah. what the fuck it is. I just found out today. Wait, what are those things? Chili like cheese Fritos? Okay. Well, Jesus. Oh, that's scary, dude. I'm sorry. Yeah. Like a bone spur? Is that what they're called? I, no, he said it's like a fatty hey, tissue. Whoa. It's like some kind. So it is the chips. It's the fatty <laughs> tissue, bro. <laughs> oh, my God. You got a fucking mm. crunchy Cheeto on your back? They congealed in one spot. Yeah, I don't know enough about it, but dude said you might want to talk about the surgery because where this is pressing, if it grows, like he's like, first of all, he said there's nothing to worry about, except if it does grow, <laughs> when you get older, you might be incontinent. What is incontinent? Like you got to shit through a bag? Like you shit your pa pants and stuff. <laughs> like you can't control your fucking shit, bro. Well, that's hella funny. Isn't that normal? Look at one side of it. <laughs> yeah, which I see out of out of any of us, I see that mostly for you, Kyle. So I think that, <laughs> right. that would be the coolest for you right. out of the four of us. Is it pee or po and poo or just poo? I think it's just poo. I think you could still hold your pee. They're different tracks, bro. We're back. They're different <laughs> tracks. No, I think it's. I think it's. No, they're different tracks. Wow. Those are different. Those are those are different pipes. Well, yeah. Then take then take care of that for sure, dude. That's that's scary. I know. I was tripping. I was tripping. I'm getting another MRI today too on my back to try to figure it out. The bummer about my groin is I. He was like. Dude, uh, he was like, yo, bro, fuck, I don't know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Dr. Right, Brozark right. here. Right. Uh, he says it's a, I keep forgetting the name of it, but it's basically like the meniscus of your hip joint is mm -hmm. torn. Mm. And he it, basically, he was like, you're a bitch, bro, because he's like, a lot of times this <laughs> is sure. torn and people don't feel it. And mm -hmm. he's like, you're oh. experiencing a lot of pain. And I don't understand why this is hurting you this badly. Sensitive. Mm. And so we're going to do some injections. <laughs> yeah, I know. He was like, basically, you're a bitch. But he was like, he was essentially, he was like, I wish this were a hernia because then I would know exactly how to treat it. I don't know how to treat this. God, I wish this was a hernia. <laughs> He's like, I've never seen this shit in my life. So now I have to go to another specialist, <laughs> too. Uh, oh, someone God. that deals with... Uh, some other shit. I fuck if I know, but meniscus. Yeah, I'm I'm getting uh, plugged in up here to like my general practitioner and all that stuff, and just like <laughs> I'm like, oh god, here we go. I bet you are. Plug your Tesla in, bitch. I'm gonna find <laughs> out, dude. It's, and then as soon as you start to walk down the walk down the the track, you're like, oh my, everything's fucked up on on me. Mm. Just throw away this body. Yeah, man, just don't go. But isn't it isn't it good? It made me feel good. I'm like, you know what? Fucking, what is this shit Wait, in my back? Ooh. Okay, but you know what? I'm young enough. I could do a surgery. It hasn't gotten crazy yet. This is the time to go in and fucking dig, right? Yeah, yeah. Dig deep. This is it. And then I you get prepped for the next fucking, you know, ten years of your life or however long it's gonna be. <laughs> I like Blake's uh, Blake's angle of like, just don't go. Like, just ride it out, and if something hurts, just be like, just bury it. Yeah, man. Don't don't let anybody know. <laughs> uh, well, that by the way was Isaac's suggestion uh, yeah. to me when I was like, "Dude, I'm in so much pain, my groin." He's like, uh, "You'll probably be good. I have a margarita." Yeah. <laughs> I I don't know, dude. I'm like, I'm in a lot of pain, and I've been in pain for months and months now. And he's like, "It'll probably just go away." And I'm like, maybe, maybe not, pizza, though. Pizza. It's right. been months and months and months and months. As soon as this dude said, "I got a fucking thing on my back." And he was yeah. like, you could be incontinent later on in life if you don't handle it. I'm like, that's the poop pants. I'm like, is this? That's the poop one. Why I've had fucking issues with like, with my digestion. And he's like, yup. Your pickleball game? And I'm like, no fucking way, bro. Like this thing could possibly be that. Can you imagine how good at pickleball you'd be if you weren't shitting <laughs> your pants all the time? Yeah, dude. So what, so what do you mean your digestion? So like what, cause your poops are like extra smelly or like, what's the deal? It's science. It's not smelly. It's just they're not as regular as I want them to be, you know? <laughs> they're not smelly? They're not smelly. Your shit doesn't stink. They're smelly. Every shit stinks. <laughs> Show me a shit that doesn't stink. Okay, so yeah, what what do you mean your what do you mean your digestion? I didn't know that you have like problems with your digestion. Well, I've talked about it before. My fissures, my fissures and my hemis. My fissures and my hemis. My hemorrhoids. Right. <laughs> oh, know? sure. But but this could all be walked back. Oh, I didn't know that th those were di digestion related. They are. Yeah. Oh, okay. They are.
I didn't either. I thought that's just when you had a big old turds. Yeah, this has been a very intimate uh, conversation. Kind of forgot we were podcasting here. <laughs> I thought, sorry, I thought fissures and hemis were when you when, when you were straining so hard that your asshole explodes. Yeah, that's what I thought that was. That's one. Split your asshole open, yeah. Well, I asked him. I, I asked him if this could be affecting anything going on in that region, and he's sure. like, "Yeah, bro, yeah, we're this shit is fucking growing." Good, bro, <laughs> for sure, bro. And then he did. Did he say you're a fucking disaster, <laughs> my guy? You also went to Doctor Brozark. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> I go to Doctor Brozark as well, dude. <laughs> yes, um, we, yeah, sake, dude. Yeah, bro. Fuck. So, Wait. okay, Kyle. <laughs> Kyle, so if you don't... I hella forgot we were podcasting. Either you I hella forgot we were podcasting, guys. No, let's just let's just get out of it. Let's get out of this. <laughs> well, you got to remember, brother. You got to. Don't be the Liam yeah. Neeson. Yeah. You're just talking talking with your buddies about your bodily Yeah, issues. let's get out of this. <laughs> no. <laughs> let's get out of this. Don't, don't be the Liam Neeson of the pod, dude, all right? <laughs> so you're saying if you don't cut this Cheeto off your spine, you're going to start shitting your pants in how many years? I didn't get into that. I was just like... I need hard lines. How long can I ride it out? I'll, I'll let you know. I guess I got to follow this up now because we are podcasting. <laughs> so I'll let you know. <laughs> Fuck. Damn, dude, that's crazy. <laughs> Unreal. Yeah, you, we, yeah. I mean, yeah. I'm going to pray for you, dude. Thank you. Thank you. He said it yeah. was nothing to worry about, Thoughts though. But, prayers. you know, yeah. You're thank a you. Fucking thank disaster, you. my guy. Scary stuff. Wow, oh, dude. Man. Well, that's disappointing that that, that back cracking didn't fully heal you, Adam, because those are those like back crackers that you watch on Instagram where it literally looks like you die for a second because they crack your neck so fucking hard. I was like, watching it through my fingers it was terrifying yeah it was pretty fucking scary especially when they're like breaking out like tools like the strap around my neck i'm like this is is this how i die yeah right I, I, and i was in so much pain that day i was like yeah those youtube yeah. videos are perverted though it's it uh I, yeah I, w I wish it worked maybe i need to go m perverted more reg like regularly but oh I have a good physical mm -hmm. therapist, and I just I just need to keep keep at it. I think you know, it sucks, but it is what it is. What would you liken the feeling to immediately after? Are you getting like a dose of euphoria, or is it like? Oh, I guess I like it. <laughs> no, it's like it's like you stepped in front of a truck, and then someone pulled you back right before you were uh, brutally killed. It was like I'm dead. And then you didn't die, and you're like, oh. So it's like, oh. <laughs> you don't know what that's like. <laughs> oh. Adam's okay. the only one who does know what that's like. <laughs> yeah, um, damn. I don't know what that's like. Yeah, I just stood, I just stood in front of it. <laughs> so it's just like you're getting yoinked. Yeah, it's it's dude. I I wish that was what Adam always used as an example. <laughs> like, what does it feel like? Well, yeah. it, it kind of feels like uh, you almost got hit by a cement truck. <laughs> During the Macy's Day Parade, there's a lot of nerves. It's almost like you're standing in front of a truck and your best friend pulls you out of the way just in the nick of time. <laughs> just in time. Wish I knew what that felt like. Okay, and back to you at the studio. Uh, oh, the, the, well, by the way, this is the year of parades for me. Oh, uh, I'm yeah, because yeah, I'm doing the uh, I am the king of Bacchus, which oh, is a huge shit. parade in uh, uh, New Orleans. Yes. And yes. I'm going to be the, the king of the parade. And the list is incredible. Like, their list of past kings are like Dom DeLuise <laughs> and... Whoa, that's big. <laughs> way hey, yeah. way to lead. <laughs> yes. From, uh, was he an American tale? Dude. Yeah, well, that's like old. <laughs> yes, he was, Durs. That's my reference. Yeah, he's the fucking cat. That, that was like... Uh, old and then and then it goes uh, like in the 80s it's like uh Hulk Hogan and John Claude Van Damme okay and Val Kilmer and Gandolfini after right after you did Hard Target probably and uh and then like Elijah Wood and Sean Astin back to back years oh shit and then uh and Anthony Mackie uh, Will Farrell John C. Bobo Riley, and, uh, and then here we here we are in 2023, and it's me, baby. 
Um, and it's it's gonna be a, it's gonna be a true epic throwdown. What the hell is it? It's just uh, what are what are your duties? It's it's essentially just a yeah my duties. Uh, essentially, I'm like uh -oh. I, I really I don't know. I'm like excited to me. find out. Uh, I think it like Friday night there's gonna be like a big party, a big welcoming party, and then Saturday's pretty chill, and then Sunday is the parade. And the parade mm, is right. like five hours long. I'm just aggressively throwing out beads, and then there's a giant party that lasts till like Perfect. five a.m. Whoa. Uh, so I, th I think it's going to be like a true epic throwdown. And by the way, the guy told me he's like, only one king has made it till the very end. Oh, shit. On Sunday night. Anthony Mackie. Uh, and that was and that was Anthony Mackie. <laughs> How did you know? <laughs> Durs, you got it. I, what He was paced it? himself. Yeah. Yeah, you got it, dude. I knew it. Yeah, it was. It was Anthony Mackie. I knew it. He's a pro. And I'm like, oh, shit, dude. I have to. I guess he's a New Orleans local. Mm. So, like, he knew what to do. He knew what to expect. So, uh, yeah, I, I'm, I'm, I plan on going long, hard, and strong. I'm kind of stoked I knew it was Anthony Mackey. <laughs> yeah, dude. He's a party pro. Well, it's, the, yeah, the thing is, though, I don't need to piss, dude. I just want to My body party. takes up, mm. uh, just gobbles up alcohol, <laughs> and I piss it right out, man. And then I. Right. Adam is like Sandman. <laughs> Adam is the Sandman yeah. of the friend group. He can just kind of absorb and sh shape shift. Yeah, I just absorb it. That's cool, dude. <laughs> right. And it's so is it heavy partying all three days or you save some in the tank for the last day? Like, how do you pace this out? Come on, you know our guy. What are you doing? Well, I know. I think what it is is we get in third. I get in Thursday night and there's like a little the restaurant what's cool is like since i'm the king they straight up close restaurants down wow. that's good nice. it's gonna be crazy yeah, yeah so it's nice. gonna be like nuts and so uh thursday uh we're i'm my guess is we'll go out big thursday we'll go out big friday saturday guy, pal. it'll me. be like daytime stuff mm -hmm. and then at nighttime mm -hmm. kind of crash early because sunday uh is like the true main event is Holy what shit. the plan is. Mm -hmm. My my guess is that it's gonna be full on the entire time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's just my yeah. guess. Yeah. That's I just my guess. guess. Yeah, is they're rolling me back into the room uh, um, Sunday morning. Halligator. That's gonna be psycho. But but I yeah you know I'm gonna go to the children's hospital. Oh, and, you're confident uh, you're gonna make you it. See the kids. What's up, guys? <laughs> we'll play. Yeah, I've never, Kyle, I've never not made anything. Who listens to the pod? No, I mean, like, you're confident you're going to make all days, like, you're going to do the Anthony Mackie. <laughs> yeah, I've never not. <laughs> Fuck yeah, bro. <laughs> okay, okay. Yeah, I mean, what do you think, do you think I, w I would ever quit? Do I don't you, know. Do you see give up in, in me? <laughs> Only if they make you get up early. Is there a time where you have to get up? Yeah, yeah. What are these call times? That's what I mean. I'm like, I'm like, you, you're talking. Naked no, grandma! I, well, they were, they were like, no, it'll be, your, it won't be early. It'll be like 9 30, 10 a.m. And I'm like, That's what if it's early. noon? Uh -huh. And they go, hey, you're the king. It can be noon. And I'm like, whoa, great. Oh, so, oh okay. Great. Wow. How yeah, interesting. They're just going to change all the clocks. You're going to be like, actually, it's yeah. not that time. <laughs> yeah, dude. Dang, that's going to be fucking wild. Yeah, so I think I think it uh, it'll all be very very doable. Nice. I've never done yeah. any sort of Mardi Gras at all. I, yeah. I don't know much about the traditions, but it seems like it's very fun. I bet it's a very buzzball friendly atmosphere. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. If I get a, like a Absolutely. buzzball little uh, beads, that could be sick. Little? Dude. Yeah, get your Big, buzzball biggies. on, baby. Biggies. Oh wow, that would look cool, dude. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, we got an opportunity. Wake up, the Big Easy. So what's going on? With, are you talking with Buzzball behind our backs, Blake? Or is there? I I heard rumors that you might be talking to Buzzball. Yeah, we had a little conference call last week. Oh, uh, we got some, so we've got some things hey, in man. the work over. Over here. This guy's going corporate. Oh my god! Yeah, <laughs> he's as the kids say, it. securing the bag of buzz balls. Yes, that's yes. Great. Bro, Twitter will be bag. a buzz. We're uh, trying to trend, baby. Let's go. I mean, smooge. They're they're dude, packing up the smooge for, for us, guys. I want you to taste it. Oh, we got a smooge boy. 
Damn. I'm, I'm excited to sip on a smooge. And Kyle. Smoothie, BB, what up? Get a little sploosh. If you get a little sploosh right here, it's not a big deal. <laughs> and Kyle, you're riding the liquid death train all the way into the station or what, oh, baby? Oh, bro, yeah. Just like uh, every one of us. Yeah, dude. That's cool, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man. Yeah. I like that, man. Wow. We got a lot of big things popping in the new year. We do. Hey. Kyle, can you put beer into your mouth and then spit it out? Yeah. Not the movie, but a lot of other things. <laughs> Wait, what, what? What did Durst just ask me? This is a good one. Like, can you, can you, can you, like, drink, a, can you put a shot of alcohol in your mouth and then spit it out or not? Like, like mouthwash it? Yeah, it's like, it's like, yeah. your question is, what? what are the lines? But why would you? What are the lines? Your question is, where is the line? <laughs> Where is the line? Yeah. For an alcoholic. <laughs> like, can you, like, just wet your... I don't know. I know that I, I, I will smell. If I want to partake and be like, oh, you what is that wine like? I'll fucking throw my my right. nose up in it and fucking smell that shit. Right. Yeah. I don't feel like you're the type of person that, like, if you, sm like, were around it, like, you would absolutely need to do it. Especially at this point, right? It's been, like, a damn decade, right? Yeah, no, I can I can smell it. I I don't know. I mean, I I have never taken a drink. I've never taken a sip and then not swallowed it. Um, like I, I haven't. I've mm -hmm. just smelled. That's it. That's my boy. <laughs> That's mm -hmm. my guy. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. You're you are a swallower. Mm -hmm. Hell yeah. So I don't know. I don't know where that yeah. would be. I mean, that's an interesting question. Okay. All right. Uh, yeah. I don't know because I want you to taste. I want you to taste the consistency of the smooge, <laughs> and I'm just wondering if like you can like. Put it in your mouth and then spit it out. Yeah. Well, what you could do is you could put it in a Ziploc bag for me, and I could. Oh, go you ahead. just put your hand in and go like, "Those are eyeballs." Yes. <laughs> like a haunted house. Yeah. Okay. Sure. Yeah. Yeah. Put it in a Ziploc bag, and then I'll put the part of the Ziploc bag in my mouth. Okay. And kind of like taste it, and then I'll s smell at the same time. Now we're getting somewhere. And then I got the consistency huh. and the smell, and huh. I'm pretty much there. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I like that. Yeah, all right. Cool. Hey, you know what? Perfect. I'm gonna do the same thing too. Then, <laughs> yeah, yeah we'll, I want to do that we'll too. We'll slap the bag. Is that still happening? Slapping the bag? That was a cool trend. I feel somewhere, somewhere it's gotta be. Oh, it should be. It should be. Absolutely. That's when you take the. That's. A, the, I feel like that's a tailgating thing. A lot of people uh, slap the bag. Uh, slap the bag. And slapping the bag is where you take the Franzia, right? Bladder out of the box of wine. Uh, yeah, box wine. Yeah. Yes. Yes. You take that big ass right. indestructible bag, the the udder, and you you, uh, you slurp it and slap it. What is it? One of my favorite things that we did. It was at the it. What do you do? You just slurp it and then you just take it and you slap it the bag. That's it. Yeah. yeah. And you just yeah. hit you it just hard. Pour wine out. Okay. Yeah. yeah. But you can really smack those motherfuckers. And then uh I know. It's really cool, Kyle. I <laughs> know I remember smacking yeah. it hard. I just thought there was like a number thing where you had to smack it once or twice or hard or soft or something. What I like is at the Iowa Nebraska football game, there they were doing this thing called uh getting basted where they have a turkey baster and they fill it uh -huh. up with booze and then they go around mm. squirting it in people's mouths <laughs> and then you so say funny. let's get basted i'm like hell yeah dude i'm into that right i'm like i really like this into that and there's no <laughs> there's no like point system or anything it's just <laughs> Kind of drinking out of a baster just some mom yeah the points is if you're the drunkest you win Right. Well, if you're the drunkest, you're the... Oh, yeah, those games are cool. If you get the most basted. You're the master basted. Yeah, you would love... You would win, Blake. You'd do great. <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't based up. Well, I don't know. Adam, it would be between Adam and Blake. You'd be you'd be a, a wild success. It would be between you two, I think, right? Get on based out, baby. Yeah, yeah I, I would say. <laughs> yeah, I like that. Body. <laughs> body. <laughs> Um, John Bastow. Speaking of John Bastow, <laughs> uh, any take backs, apologies, uh, any epic slams? I have an apology Ooh, to James okay. Cameron. Okay, wait, this is oh. this a prepared speech? He's oh. pulling out a piece of paper because I should we turn uh, the mics down and talk uh, just to James individually? Only <laughs> is yeah. that cool? Yeah, hey, Jimmy, yeah. Uh, I just want to apologize. I just yesterday finally saw Avatar, and I'm sorry about that. Um, 
I, I, honestly wild that it took you that long. Yeah, what the fuck? I know. I'm a busy guy. You're you're maybe the biggest Avatar fan that I know. And yes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, he's uh, not kidding. Took you. <laughs> Basically, I wanted to like bring the kids, right? Like I didn't mm -hmm. want to just go see it and mm -hmm. then be like, man, I saw Avatar. My kids being like, what the fuck? What? <laughs> right. You know. Yeah. Um, yeah. Good. Good dad. So what? Now, are your kids old enough to appreciate how dope it was? Because it's, it's long. Yeah, and we, it's super long. So like my Dude. real youngster was yeah. like, by with him, there's like 45 minutes left. He didn't shut up the entire time. He was just like, <laughs> 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 um, whopper, whopper, chicken nugget. <laughs> he was like, whopper, whopper, single, double. <laughs> but uh, it was tight. It was cool. Who would you say liked it the most? Uh, well, they, they both came home and started drawing shit immediately. The dopest Whoa. thing about these movies, like, they're not, like, you know, super game-changer stories or characters or whatever. Mm -hmm. But, like, you have to go, oh, yeah, none of this is real. This is all animated. It all looks real. But the animals are fucking dope. Like, I don't know. I just think it's It's so cool. cool how they make that movie. Whenever I see behind-the-scenes footage of, like, James Cameron being the animals and like mm -hmm. right there next to him and they're just right. like in this space and he's like using this giant head to be a placeholder to like sniff them and smell them or whatever yeah. and then yeah. it's fucking yeah. sick dude. He's a genius and the the action sequences look, look I mean I know if like you have a location you can kind of map out your shit and I know that they will like build him the location bef like computer wise so he can see and like plan the the shots but you're like how did the geography like how does he know that they're gonna fall this way when it's turning and like water's filling up this way and now they're in this room it's just crazy yeah it's just crazy yeah it, tr it truly is a very impressive and incredible and honestly i loved the second movie and it for me i mean i i went as an adult and i didn't have kids with me so like mm -hmm. i was fully immersed i like it could have gone on longer. And usually, yeah. like, a three-hour movie, like, I'm, like, the type of person that, like, an hour and a half in, I'm like, mm -hmm. and let's wrap it up. <laughs> right, right. Let's get on out of here. Yeah, that's how I kind of am, too, sometimes. It's about that time. Yep. Like, yep. you know, if it, if it gets over two hours, I'm like, who the fuck do you think you are? Mm -hmm. And th this, this the, the, the entire time, I was fucking stoked yeah so team team avatar over here wow everybody's on the avatar train dude hell yeah you guys it's it's so good and my kids i don't think they'd been to a 3d movie because they were tripping on it they were oh, like yeah. reaching out for stuff uh oh. and i was oh, like really? oh, oh, man. it's not real <laughs> <laughs> yeah stop yeah quit embarrassing me yeah. you idiot stop trying to grab her uh <laughs> wait but here's a question here here so there was somebody sitting behind me talking the entire time. Okay. And I was like, Jesus fucking Christ. Like, what the fuck is going on? Yeah. Then I realized they were translating for somebody. Oh. Okay. Okay. Wow. So, like, they yeah. were with... An From, like, French to English or something? I mean, so... Older, yeah, yeah French dude. definitely French. <laughs> For, definitely fucking French guys. Yeah. Fucking French guys, man. What the fuck? No, it was it was like a old it was like an old Asian lady and maybe her daughter or a younger Asian person was like uh, translating it, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. At least that's what I ended up figuring out because they would only talk like right after everyone talked, and I'm like, Jesus, is this okay? Like, <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't know. No, absolutely, it's not. Absolutely, that's not. You have to. Well, then what are they? Or what if it's like a blind person? Is it okay to hear somebody be like, okay, and now they're on, they're on the dragons, they're flying? Yeah. No. I think it's okay. I think it's okay. Let's be real. Or do they have to sit in the way back Let, row? You have to wait until the movie comes out at home. No. No, because it's no. 3D. If if you need if you need no. You gotta have the 3D experience. Was the theater packed? No, and it was not packed. It was okay. like 3:30. Right. It was like right after school. So there should be a space. That's there fair. should be a space for this. But you gotta go to the back row, no? Yes. Yes, they do. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. What if we have showings? What if we have um showings where people go and 
and uh, you know interpret for people. Well, yeah, well, then why you're don't you cry about it? Yeah, just put a space. Bring your translator showings. Yeah, yeah, translator showings. And there's just like a German guy being like, "Nein, ich nicht." That's kind of cool. Ich liebe like a tra- a trans. You're saying a trans showing. <laughs> well, wait a minute. Wait, what? Yeah, that would be cool. Yeah, trans showing. Well, can't you just like when you go to Alcatraz, a like when you go visit showing. Alcatraz and shit, you put on the little like history things and you get. Yeah. Everyone knows what it's like to visit Alcatraz. Yes, that would be nice. Yes, I would hope so. And you get the little translations. <laughs> I've, I, Kyle, I've been. I've been there. <laughs> you know, if you could, they should. <laughs> I would hope so. It's very good. You get the headphones and it's like, you hear like the clanking of the jail doors. And it's like, this is where <laughs> yeah. Al Capone slept for a month before yes. he was murdered. Yeah, dude. I got to get back to Alcatraz. <laughs> That's hella fascinating. I want to go as a man. I've never been. It sounds fun. Dude. It's really cool. Let's go. Come up to the bay. Let's go to Alcatraz. Yeah. It would be sick. Oh, fuck yeah. (laughs) Yeah, it's man trip to Alcatraz. (laughs) All right. (laughs) We're going to the rock, baby. Well, dude, I... I am bummed that, you know, we we were planning on doing, obviously we're going to do the movie here in a... Uh, Let's go to The Rock. We'd be shooting it, like, right now. Uh, uh-huh. Uh-huh. While, when this podcast comes out. It sucks that we aren't all together. We all need to get together during this time and at least uh, have have some fun. Let's go to Alcatraz. You know? These two came over to my house the other night. That's true. Yeah, come on. Let's... let's... I hope we hung out. Oh, shit. Why wasn't I invited? Well, uh, you, why wasn't uh, here's here's what it comes down to. You were in Indonesia or something. We have to talk about that next pod. Your cruise, dude. Was he already gone? Yes, he was gone. Oh, you were already gone. Oh yeah, he was. He wasn't yeah. in town. It was it wasn't a cruise. It wasn't a cruise. Well, okay, we'll figure it out. Uh, oh, I wasn't in town. Oh, okay, okay. All right, well, let's yeah. wrap it up and jump right back on. And well, well, debatable. When did you guys go? Let's get to the bottom of this. Oh, next week. <laughs> Fuck okay. It. They went oh, to my tune, tune in next week. That's another episode of. <laughs> of this, this is, is important. Oh, I take back what I said about important. What do you take back? <laughs> Tesla, Tesla. I realize it's actually dope.